Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set says that Madhav is the lab assistant in a chemistry lab and he has a beaker that has 33 ml of acid and he has to give 11 milliliter of acid to three students and there are three other beakers available. Their values are 18, 15 and 7 ml. Okay. So he has 33 ml, 18, 15 and 7 ml. He needs to distribute this 11 ml to each of these. Okay. Now the beakers are kept on a table and need to be lifted in order to transfer the acid in them. Okay. So if you have to transfer from one to another, you will have to lift and transfer. Although uh, a beaker lifted once can be used to transfer to multiple beakers. Let us say initially this is filled. We can transfer to multiple beakers. Like we can put 18 here and 15 here, 18 and 7 here. That will be considered as a single lift. Okay. Now he has to distribute into three equal parts using only these beakers and no beaker has an intermediate mark for measurement. So you can measure 18 ml, 15 ml, but you cannot measure 10 ml in the 15 ml beaker. Similarly, you cannot measure uh, 6 ml in the 7 ml beaker. Okay. So using this, we have to make the measurements, right? So the question is, what is the minimum number of times he needs to lift the beakers to distribute the acid? So basically minimum number of transfers that he has to make and all the questions are based on it. So let us start. So initially it is 33,000. <coughs> now he needs to make 11, uh, like, uh, 11 ml in this okay so now we have to try to find out ki how can you make 11 in the minimum possible chance so if we see this difference between 18 and 7 is 11 okay so what if one one thing is 18 plus 7 uh, like 18 minus uh, 7 is 11 that means he will transfer 18 here and 7 here and he can get 11 here right Another thing we can think is 33, if he distributes 15 and 7, 15 plus 7 is 22. If he distributes 22, he will be left with 11. Okay. So that seems a, a better way because we can directly get 11 here. So he will lift the beaker once and distribute 15 here and 7 here. Right. So this will be left with 11. So this is the first lift. Now, this is 15 and 7 uh, and if he like uh, uh, like transfers 15 here uh, like he can get uh, 22 out of these two he can put uh, if he fills this 18 he will be able to get four more and he needs seven more to make it 11 okay so let us do the next process let us try to fill this 18 so if we fill Next, if you fill 7 here, it will be 7 and it will be 15 and then 0. Then next, we will try to put, uh, fill it completely so that we have 18 and 4 left here. So next step will be 7, 11 and this will be 18. Okay, and this will be left with 4 and this is 0. Okay, next what we can do is if we transfer 7 here, we will be left with 11. So fourth transfer would mean 11, 11, then 4 and 7. Okay. Now we can just pour this 7 ml back and we will get 11 ml. So 11, 11, 11 and 0. So that is the minimum possible number of turns we can take to fill this beaker. Okay. So uh, you could try with other combinations also. You will not get uh, lesser steps than this one. So the first question is the minimum number of times he needs to lift the beaker. So first he is lifting this beaker and transferring into these two. Then he is lifting this beaker and transferring here. Right, second uh, thing. Then third time he is transferring uh, uh, this this content here. Okay. Then he is transferring this content here. Then finally he is transferring this content here. So five times he is making the transfer. If he transfers the acid using the minimum number of lifts, which beaker will be filled in the end? So the 15 ml beaker will be filled in the end. 
If we transfer acid using the minimum number of lifts, how many times the 7 ml beaker will be completely filled? Okay. So it is filled two times, one time and two times. If you transfer using uh, the minimum number of lifts, which of the following is the volume in one of the beakers during the process? Right. So we see that only 4 ml is the volume in this beaker at uh, uh, intermediate position in the process. So that is the solution to the set and answers to the questions.